My name is Dominic Sieber. I am 29 years old and I am from Switzerland. And be member of the or proud member of the almighty infamous Drift Bastards Drift Team. So. The team exists since about 2015. We are a sworn circle of colleagues. But it took us about three years to decide if we want to appear as a team with the same looking cars, colors, livery, etc. etc. One member was very attached to the color of his car and didn't want to go along with us. So in a nightly action the car was simply repainted. The members are Michael Riedweg with his Turbo MX-5 he is currently building a PS13. My brother Yannick Sieber, Renato Müller with his S13 LS, Alex Meyer, the driver of the S14, and me with the 350C. We are five members. We are mainly a team that rides for the fun. We are not championship related, we just decide spontaneously at which event we ride. We also participate in single championship races and events that we enjoy. SR22 of a dude at an event. He did not get along with the car, then he told me to drive it. I thought to myself, why not, come on. The car had the whole event already problems with the engine, which did not run properly. And after 20 minutes, I blew it up. I am currently very fond of four-door cars, so towards Nissan R32 or R32. My favorite tracks are Jura South and Pussy de la Valle. Fortunately, I had only minor incidents so far. I had never been insured. But I surely managed once in the season to get the trailer 
directly after the crash, because the damage is so irreparable even without Bangladesh repair practices. My favorite drifter at the moment is Luke Fink, because he is just living out a zero fucks glow. Naoki Nakamura and Chelsea Denofa also. The day we tested the newly built Nissan S13 for the first time in Anno de Rhin. After three years of construction, we were very hyped to move the car for the first time. Except of a toasted clutch, everything was running fine. One week before I had a vehicle inspection appointment, I crashed my 350C in Anno de Rhin. Hardly in the war. First, you have to lock the differential. LSD or welded is fine. The most important thing is that you have to ride off the car. From the moment when you are on the track for the first time, there is simply the chance that you will scrap the car. The car must not mean anything to you, because that doesn't stop you from trying everything if you are worried about not breaking anything. This is my experience that I want to pass on because I have been paying attention to it for too long. The ultimate beginner track I highly recommend is Bourbonnais in France. <laughs>